If it's Wednesday, it is time for your money. And today we have a treat. We have an expert that is going to help you live your best life while also being financially savvy. Her name is Michaela James and she is the bougie budgeter. It is so wonderful to have you on the show this morning. Thank you for joining us. And before we get into anything, can you please set the record straight and explain what bougie is? Because my two co-hosts and I were, were going back and forth. So set, set us all straight, please. Okay, so um, hello, good morning. Thank you so much for inter um, bringing me on today. So my definition of bougie is living your life by a specific standard that no one else can can stray you away from. So whether it's you like to be upscale, whether it's like you like to be mid-level, it doesn't matter, just as long as no one can take you away from whatever standard of life or quality of life you deserve to live. All right, I like that one. It's very diplomatic, but I'll buy that for a dollar. Michael, <laughs> you're speaking specifically, you're speaking specifically to Gen Z. Why Gen Z? Because um, I think that we have really skipped over the idea of what it really looks like to educate from a techno technology standpoint. And also, for some reason, people think that Gen Z are like, 15 year olds making TikTok videos, but they're actually in the workforce. They're pro young professionals just like me and you. And there has to be some type of information geared to how they learn, which is a lot differently because of the advancements of technology. I love that you just said that because honestly, that's what I was thinking of. My son, who's 14, making TikTok videos, Gen Z, but they are in the workforce. And I love this point you make. You said stress comes from a lack of money management skills, not from a lack of funds. So what are you doing to change that? Yeah, absolutely. So I, I find that I work with a lot of young professionals and these are, you know, people fresh out of college making 60, 70, $80,000 a year. So it's not that they don't make enough money, it's that they have poor management skills. And, you know, a lot of times we haven't been taught financial literacy, but also we haven't been taught how to use the technology that has been created, whether that's direct deposit, um, auto pay. A lot of people think that you have to be rich to put your bills on auto pay, but it's just more of you have to be strategic and really focus on where your money is going and understanding how to create that budget or that roadmap to where you want to be in your financial freedom. And I, I love this point that you're making, which I think would work across generations, which is create a community of financial excellence. What does that mean exactly? Yeah, I think that we have gone so long without talking about money to our friends, our family, uh, just the people around us. And we have to stop that. We have to make sure that we are speaking to each other. We're trying to, we have to figure out what other people are doing and also bringing in some professionals. So whether that's getting a money coach, whether that is following a financial influencer, or if it's going to a CPA or a financial advisor, getting help is really how you create that circle of excellence to make your money, to move your money from one place to financial freedom or, you know, the, the top of the line, the bougie status. Right. And, and I like that you say, you know, part of this community is finding someone that understands money and it's not always auntie. It's not always, you know, your godparent that sometimes you have to go out and spend a little money to learn about money. Before we go, you have a workbook, Financing Your Best Life, The Financially Innovative Guide to Avoiding Financial Rock Bottom. What is your workbook going to teach folks? So my workbook is that one-stop shop, you know, where you first learn about how to really budget using technology, using that, like I said, you don't have to be rich to be on auto pay. So I do a four-step system. It's called the financial flow that takes you from your income. It makes you look at your expenses, then puts you through to your savings and to your spending, but with all different types of um, exercises to help you goal set, to help you start creating good financial habits because everything starts with the habit. And then also it teaches you mm -hmm. some other tips and tricks that I can't say too much about. You have to get the book, but mm -hmm. it is really an all-inclusive <laughs> one-stop shop for people who just want to learn how to use technology and 
you know, manage their money and finance their best life. Michael James, the bougie budgeter. Thank you so much for your tips. We thank appreciate it. Thank you so much it. for having me.